Hello. Hi, I'm looking for the president of the Sweet Potato Council. You got him. There's something Americans have been confused about for a long time. Yeah, we were hoping you could clear something up for us, which is what is the difference between a sweet potato and a yam? <laughs> okay. A sweet potato and a yam are nothing alike. It turns out that what grocery stores in the U.S. have been calling yams, they're actually just sweet potatoes. A sweet potato is the orange flesh potato you'll see today in your supermarket. The orange kind are the most common today, but they can also be purple. And originally, all sweet potatoes had white or yellowish flesh. And a yam looks like this. It's kind of brown covered and white on the inside. And you would only find it in a specialty store in the United States. More than 90% of yams are grown in West Africa, where they've been a staple food for thousands of years. So if they're completely different vegetables, why do the grocery stores label sweet potatoes as yams? That name come about in the United States in the 20s. Louisiana farmers advertised their moist orange sweet potatoes as yams to try to stand out from the other sweet potatoes at the time. But they didn't come up with that word out of nowhere. It was already being used for some sweet potatoes in the 19th century. So where did it come from? Well, here's a clue. The word yam was probably derived from these West African words. And the most obvious way that African words could travel to the southern United States? Slavery. So when West African people were forcibly moved to the New World, they probably used the word yam to refer to the root vegetable that they found there. The sweet potato. Alright, it's time to try my first ever true yam. Boiled. Mm. Much more similar to a potato than a sweet potato. Mm. 